Hey, it's Siri. Welcome back to another video on my channel. In today's video, I want to talk about how to make money as a complete beginner in 2020 without a website, without having to spend money on advertising, and as a complete beginner. So I'm very excited to share this information with you. And before I really dive into things, if this is the, if this is the first time that you're on my channel and you enjoy videos about how to make money online, how to do affiliate marketing, and different ways on how you, how, how you could, of course, work from home, I'm always putting out content on a regular basis that will show you how you could do just that. So if you enjoy videos like that, definitely be sure to subscribe to this channel down below. But anyways, in this video in particular, I want to go over a four-step formula that will help you make money with ClickBank as a complete beginner in 2020. So I'm very excited to, of course, share this information with you. And uh, if any, if at any point in this video you decide that you want to, of course, you know, dive deeper and you want to learn more about how to make money with not just ClickBank, but with affiliate marketing in general, and you really want to build an entire business around this concept where you could be your own boss, you could work on your own terms and pretty much have that lifestyle of freedom, uh, then at any, any point in this video, you could always visit my free training down below which is the very first link in the description. And that will go more, much more into depth about how to build a business online through the concept of affiliate marketing. So without further ado, let's get right into it and let's talk about how to make money on ClickBank as a complete beginner. Let's get right into it. All right, so here I have the four steps laid out and we're just gonna go uh, through them one by one. So step number one, uh, this one's gonna be pretty obvious, is set up a ClickBank account. So this is pretty obvious. You just want to, of course, if you have not already done this, what you'll want to do is you'll want to go to clickbank.com and you'll want to, of course, set up your account. What all you have to do to do this is you just want to go to the top right of ClickBank, you know, to this button right here, create account. You want to click on that button and then just uh, follow the steps on setting up your account with ClickBank right there. So pretty self-explanatory stuff right there. I shouldn't really have to, of course, go into it. If you sign up to any other website in the past, you probably know, you probably have a good understanding of, of course, you know, what to expect. But uh, yeah, that's the first step that you'll want to do. And this this is some uh, something that I, of course, want to bring up. Uh, something that I personally find crazy is that there's a lot of people online who, you know, they like to binge watch videos about, you know, how to make money online with ClickBank, how to do affiliate marketing. And, you know, they haven't even, although they've seen, a uh, you know, a whole bunch of videos on ClickBank, they haven't even taken that first step of creating an account. So make sure that if you haven't done that already, you want to go ahead and create your account with ClickBank right there. So just go through that step. And anyways, yeah, that's number one. Let's move on to step number two. Step number two is you want to select your niche and find products to promote. So um, when it comes to, of course, promoting products on ClickBank, you obviously want to, of course, select the niche that you are deciding to go in and you wanna find products that you truly believe in yourself. So to do this, you'll just wanna to go to Affiliate Marketplace right here at the top. And this will bring up a list of the different niches that you could of course pick from. So if I scroll down here, it'll show a bunch of different categories, you know, arts and entertainment, e-business, e-marketing, employment and jobs, green products, health and fitness, languages, mobile, parenting, families, politics, current events, um, all the type of stuff, you know, self-help, spirituality, uh, sports. So there's a whole bunch of different niches that you could, you could, of course, go into. But for this this example, I'm, of course, going to pick the, you know, e-business and e-marketing niche, since this is one that I have, of course, you know, very passionate about, and I consider myself rather knowledgeable about this niche. So I, of course, will, of course, you know, pick that. But ideally, you want to pick a niche that is rather... Uh, something that you are, you know, rather knowledgeable about, something that you are passionate about, and also something that is, you know, rather, um, you know, there's where there's a huge need for. So my personal recommendation is that you want to select something that is either, you know, anything regarding, you know, making money online or building an online business. It could be health and wellness, or, or it could also be like the dating slash relationships niche. So these three niches right here, these are the top three niches uh, that are pretty much evergreen. So I think you and I can agree that as long as the internet exists, there is always going to be a large group of people coming online every single day looking for different ways on how they could, you know, make more money online, how to grow a business, how to get into better shape, how to find the love of their life, how to improve their relationships, all that type of stuff. So there's always going to be people looking up, uh, you know, that type of stuff online, Google and YouTube, all that, you know, they're always looking for information in those particular areas because these are the three most areas that you know it, that you must really focus on to of course have, live 
a happy and fulfilled life. So this, these are the top three needs of most people. So my uh, personal preference is that uh, if you are, consider yourself somewhat passionate about one of those niches, I would recommend getting into one of those right there. So um, that's just one thing that I, have, of course, recommend. But, you know, there's a... Um, you know, plenty of other niches that you could, of course, consider. You know, travel is really big. Uh, there's self-help. There's e-learning. There is, you know, cryptocurrency, which is, of course, getting lots of popularity. So there's a whole bunch of different niches that you could, of course, explore. But uh, my recommendation is you want to do your own due diligence. See what's, of course, you know, where there's a huge need and where there's a good earning potential. And then you want to decide uh, on the niche that you, of course, want to get in. So once you decide that, um, you know, in my case, it's e-business and e-marketing, then you could start looking through the different products in that niche. So right here, we've got an entire list of products that I could, of course, look through. And the benefit with this niche is that uh, there's a lot of products that pay out very big commissions. And the reason for this is because people are generally willing to pay, you know, big amounts of money in order to, of course, learn how to make a consistent income online. I mean, think of it, think about it this way. People are wanting to of course, you know, people don't want to, of course, work 40 hours a week anymore at a job that they absolutely hate just to have, you know, those two days off at the end where they could just, you know, just kind of sit back and just watch TV. So this is something that a lot of people are, of course, wanting to learn more about. And because of this, because there's such a massive demand for this, there's a lot of products that pay out very big commissions, um, you know, if you decide to, of course, promote them and you make a sale. So here I could, of course, look through any of the different products here, and I could even sort by, you know, popularity, you know, average sale amount, initial sale. Um, something that I would actually recommend doing here is clicking on the gravity option. And this will show the products that are currently selling very well right now. So right here it shows um, the 12 minute affiliate system. This is a hot offer and it's, you know, for every single sale that you get of this, it's about $68.47. So for one single sale, you get that commission right there. And if you can get, you know, two sales of this per day, you're already at, you know, like a full-time income right there. So this has a gravity score of 177.03. So what that means is that there are about, you know, 177 uh, affiliates promoting this right now that are doing very well with it. They're getting lots of consistent results, you know, either on a daily or weekly basis. So that's generally very good. And my personal recommendation is you want to pick something that uh, has a gravity score of either, you know, maybe 30 or higher. That's what I would recommend. If you see a product and you see that it's not really, you know, selling that much, I probably would not recommend getting started with that as a complete beginner. So you want to pick something that is rather proven, something that is, you know, looks to be as of quality. And you want to, of course, do your own due diligence and then decide to promote that as an affiliate right there. So, I mean, that's one offer you could promote. You know, there's this uh, get paid for your opinions, real survey jobs. Okay, that's one thing you could check out. Uh, ClickBank University. This, one sale of this, $251.71 right there. Again, one sale of that per day. That's like, you know, full-time, you know, full-time full, full -time income right there. Um, you know, just from one product right hit right there. Super affiliate system, $468 uh, per single sale. So there is a very, as you can see here, there is a huge earning potential with the e-business and e-marketing niche. And this uh, has a gravity score of 50.23. So about 50 affiliates right now that are currently promoting this. They're doing very well. They're getting lots of consistent results. And this is usually a very great sign that the product is, of course, very good. So what you could do is you can click on the promote button. And then this, you could, of course, get your affiliate link right here. And what you want to do is you, of course, want to sign in to your ClickBank account, or you could just enter your ClickBank account nickname. And then you just want to click on this button right here that says Generate Hop Links. Once you do this, you will get your affiliate link, where when you send someone to this link, which I'm actually going to open up in a new tab right now. Uh, let's actually do that real quick. Uh, let's see here. Open up in a new tab. If I open that. It, of course, brings up what the uh, product, of course, looks like. So right here, it is a um, free training from John Cristani that shows you how to earn a six-figure side income online. So that's what it says right there. And anyone who lands on this page, all they have to do is click on the button, sign up for, for the free training, and then decide, okay, I want to attend, you know, Monday, 
January 27th, you know, at 12.45 a.m., select time zone, fill out their information, and that's pretty much your entire goal when you decide to promote a product like this. So if you promote something that is, you know, it gives like a free webinar the, at the beginning, your only uh, goal is to get people to sign up for this free training, and then they can, of course, go through it. Now, the benefit with this is that if someone goes through uh, this training and they go through it, you know, from your link, which, as you can see here, it has my ClickBank username at the top. This is how ClickBank knows that I am the person who referred, um, you know, the customer to this product right here. When someone goes through this training and they decide to buy the offer that John reveals at the end of the webinar, then they pay a commission on that. So they would, of course, pay a commission to the affiliate that um, referred the customer to the product right there. So that's really how affiliate marketing works there is you are just uh, re recommending other people's products and services right there. Now, the question is, how exactly do you go about promoting this? How exactly do you, um, you know, of course, go about you know, promoting an offer like this and getting someone to actually buy this product. And that's actually um, step number three is what I want to go over. And that is start driving traffic to your offers. So there's plenty of ways that you can get people to your offer. There's a whole bunch of things you could do. You could do solo ads, you know, which is, you know, like email advertising. Um, you, can, you, know, you know, you could like buy like a certain amount of clicks. You could set up, you know, like a display ad. There's a whole bunch of things that you could do. But I'm going to assume that if you're completely brand new, you know, you don't have that much money to, of course, spend on advertising, and you probably don't have a website either. So you are, of course, looking for a way on how to start driving traffic to your offer, and you want to get quality traffic to your offer. You don't want to just, you know, get a bunch of random people to click on a link and then they never buy the product. I mean, that would kind of defeat the purpose. So what you want to do is you want to focus on getting lots of high quality traffic to your offer. And one of the best ways to do this is actually through YouTube. So this is where you focus on creating content around your niche. So for example, if you're promoting something in, you know, like the, the make money online slash, you know, online business type of niche, then you should ideally be creating content in that specific niche. So create creating content about how to grow an online business, how to make money online, that type of stuff. If you if that is if you are deciding to promote promote an offer in that niche. And then when you focus on creating content on a regular basis, you know, putting up videos about that particular niche, um, you know, targeting specific keywords that people are of course looking up, then in your video descriptions, you know, which is like the description down below, you could have your links down there where when someone clicks on one of those links and they decide to check out your recommended product, then, you know, once they go through that, they get lots of value from it and they buy it, then you earn a commission that way. So the reason why I recommend YouTube a lot is because for one, it's completely free to start. You don't have to invest in anything when you, of course, start up a YouTube channel. Of course, you could always um, invest in a screen recorder if you want to do videos like this. You could invest in, you know, a Blue Yeti mic if you want to improve your audio quality. But that's really all you need to, of course, start up a YouTube channel. And even like, you know, videos on your mobile phone. I mean, most smartphones nowadays have a pretty good quality camera. So you could even use your phone. You could just take out your phone and just shoot videos like that. And as long as you are creating content on a regular basis, you're targeting keywords that, of course, are getting lots of search volume. And, you know, they have you know, rather low competition. As long as you do this on a consistent basis, this is how you build up an audience of people that, you know, they know, like, and trust you. And also the other reason why I recommend YouTube is because videos are the future. When someone sees an actual person on camera and they get lots of value from those videos and they decide to, of course, check out whatever offer you recommend. Well, think of it like this, you know, compared to like, you know, buying a bunch of clicks off of, you know, like from like a solo ad marketplace where, where people, they just go straight to the offer. When someone sees the product that you're promoting and they, you know, they get on the free training, they already know who you are. They've already seen your video. They already trust you. They already, you know, have a good, um, you know, feeling that you are of course, you know, legit because you're providing valuable information that they're looking for. And then once they, by the, you know, by the time that they uh, check out your offer, they're already much more pre-qualified to, you know, wanting to learn more about whatever it is that you have to, of course, recommend them. So the um, question is, is that, is that, you know, what, of course, would someone uh, look up if they were, you know, wanting to check out something like, you know, how to earn a six-figure side income online or how to, 
your own online business, which is really what John Cristani is teaching here. This is a training about affiliate marketing, how to do affiliate marketing online, and how to actually build an entire business around that concept. So the question is, is what would someone actually type into YouTube to find, um, you know, your videos or, you know, something uh, that you're, of course, putting out there on YouTube? Well, they could, of course, search up something like, um, you know, how to make money online or, you know, with with affiliate marketing. You know, they could search up something like that. And let's say that you put up a lot of videos, you know, over the last, you know, few months and you targeted, you know, keywords such as this. Well, it's very likely that if you are very consistent, eventually your videos are going to be noticed. And this is really uh, the uh, most important thing is that you want to be creating content on a rather consistent basis. And as long as you're doing that and you're providing lots of valuable information, this is how you build up an audience of people that know, like, and trust you. And, you know, then they could, of course, check out whatever offer it is that you recommend there. So that's really step number three is you just want to be consistent with one traffic source. And then once you start getting results, you could start expanding. You, you could do other um, methods of, of course, getting traffic. Of course, you know, there's plenty of other things that I could have, you know, shown as well. Like there's uh, solo ads you could try out. There's Facebook ads. But ultimately, what it comes down to is you want to pick one traffic source that you truly believe in, something that you could see yourself doing long term. And my personal recommendation, I just cannot recommend YouTube enough because it's completely free to start. There is, you know, videos are, you know, the best way to really build up trust with your audience. And also, once you have a big enough following and people, you know, they see your offer, this is some of the most high quality traffic that you could really get you know, pretty much anywhere online. So that's why I recommend uh, to really focus on building up, um, you know, following online. You want to, of course, focus on providing uh, content that is of value. And as long as you're willing to do that, I mean, you are going to pretty much set yourself apart from, you know, the average, you know, marketer that just, you know, sends a bunch of random clicks to a link and, you know, hopes that they make money. So, this is really what, what you want to be focusing on, especially in 2020 with the amount of competition that's out there. You really want to be focusing on standing out and really providing lots of value. So that's step number three. And then step number four is collect leads and follow up with them regularly. This is extremely important. And if you are truly looking to build a long-term business online, if you want to actually make money through ClickBank or any other affiliate marketplace consistently, then you absolutely need to be collecting leads and following up with them regularly. This is extremely important. So how exactly do you go about this? Well, when you create content on YouTube or when you decide to start driving traffic with, you know, any other traffic method, it's very important that you you don't want to, you know, send people directly to, you know, your affiliate link like this. Because what here's the thing that you must understand. Most people will not buy your product right away. 99% uh, of people that see your offer even if they are interested in learning more about it, most people are not going to buy what it is that you recommend, um, you know, the first time seeing it. And that's just the unfortunate reality. Um, there are a few people here and there, uh, which are known to be called uh, hyperactive buyers. And they are a very small percentage of people that, you know, when they see something, if they truly believe in it, uh, then they, you know, they pull out the credit card, and they buy it right away, you know, they buy like a high ticket product, right then and there. But I'd say this is especially the case if you're promoting something that is in rather the high ticket range where it pays out big commissions. Um, most people are not going to buy your product right, right away. So for that reason, you don't want to be just depending on, you know, just a bunch of people that you send straight to this offer right then and there to, of course, invert. Because especially if you're spending lots of money on traffic or, you know, you're spending lots of time, you know, putting out a content um, you know, the thing is, is like people are not going to, you know, buy your product right then and there. And, you know, if you aren't collecting uh, leads and, you know, following up with them, you're going to be wasting lots of time and or money when it comes to getting traffic. So in order to really convert this traffic into actual buyers, you need to be collecting leads and following up with them regularly. Now, how exactly do you, you know, go about this? How do you go about you know, collecting people's information and then following up with them. Well, there's two tools that I'm going to recommend in this video. And these are things that if you truly want to build a business around this concept, you definitely need these two things. So I'm going to include uh, links to both of them in the description. So it is a sales funnel builder. That's how you collect leads. 
and then to follow up with them regularly regularly you will also need an email autoresponder so this is so the um sales funnel bu builder that i personally use is called clickfunnels.com and uh, you could actually get a free 14-day trial you know down in my description down below um, and then there's also aweber so aweber is the email autoresponder and this is what you use to of course send people uh, back to your offer so uh, you know a sales funnel would essentially is kind of like a website except it's designed to of course capture uh, people's information um, with you know like a capture page like if you want to see like an example of this you can go onto google and just search up you know like capture page and you'll find plenty of um, images that'll show exactly you know what a capture page looks like so right here as you can see you know get yours free discover the unique and simple method that generated you know almost four thousand dollar opt-in in five days so it, right here it's got you know all it is is it's a simple page it's got a headline uh you know giving people of course a you know an idea on what on what they'll get if they enter their name and email you know they click on the button and then they go to the next page which is known as the thank you page and this is where you could of course introduce yourself you could you know include like a video of yours and you could say hey you know thanks for requesting more information what you're going to learn here is how to you know blank how to do this how to do that you could share your story you could of course you know uh you know ex explain you know of course who you are how this product has of course helped you and then you could say at the end if you are of course ready to make this change in your life you could just click the button down below and then that will take them to where they could actually check out uh, this training here. So I'm not going to go, you know, too deep into the, like how to, of course, set up, a, a, you know, like a sales funnel, all, all the type of stuff, because I don't want to, I don't want this video to, of course, drag out forever. But if you, of course, want to learn that, uh, let me know down below and I'm, I'll be sure to, of course, make another video on that, uh, you know, down the road. But this is how you collect people's information. So once they enter their information, they get put onto your email list. And then using your email autoresponder, in my case, I use aweber.com. And like I said, this also has a free 14 day, no, not 14 day trial. This I believe gives like a free uh, one month trial that you can get. And you could actually test it out for free for an entire month. And if you don't like it, you know, you could always just cancel, you know, just make sure to, of course, you know, cancel the uh, auto, you know, renew membership. But this is how you send out emails to your list of you know people that of course request more information and then you could either get them back to the offer at any point you could send them an email say hey have you gotten a chance to watch john cristani's free training yet if you have not done so make sure to do that because you will really learn a lot here you can send an email like that and you can get them back to the offer just at any point or what you, what you could even do is you could send them to you know videos that you of course put out there so you could build up a relationship by uh sending them videos that you of course uploaded or if you're building like a website, um, you could even send them like um, like blog articles and you could, of course, you know, provide them with more value. And this is how you get people to trust you more. And once they trust you more, then they're much more open to checking out whatever it is you recommend. And as long as you do this rather consistent long enough, then eventually people who, of course, they trust you, they want to learn more. They want to, of course, change their life if their desire is strong enough then they will check out their you know the, the you know program you recommend and then they will buy the product so that is really how that all that works and this is really this step right here is so critically important if you are not focusing on this then you cannot really expect to make um you know that much sales in the long term of course you can make some sales here and there but if you want to make you know truly consistent you know income with this you definitely need to be collecting leads and following up with them regularly. So this is extremely important. And then as a bonus, step number five is just be consistent and provide lots of value. So this is really what it, what it all comes down to. If you are not consistent with what you do, if you are just kind of, you know, putting in some work here and there, you just kind of, you know, doing, you know, if you're just creating content whenever you feel like it, or, you know, you're just, um, you know, you spend more time, uh, consuming information rather than producing value, then uh, you can't really expect to, you know, have those long-term results. So if you want consistent results, you need to be putting in the consistent work. Most people, unfortunately, you know, they they like to consume a lot, but they don't actually like to, you know, produce on a cons consistent basis. So 
this is one of the most important things when it comes to uh, not just succeeding with affiliate marketing, but with anything for that matter. If you want consistent results in any area of your life, you have to put in the work on a, cons on a consistent basis. So that's really uh, what it all comes down to there. And I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up because it really does help the channel. Uh, let me know your feedback down in the comments down below. Did you find value in this video? I'd really appreciate uh, your feedback down below. And as I mentioned in the beginning of this video, if you want to check out my uh, free training down below, uh, the first link in the description will give you access to my free training, and that will show you much more in depth about how to build an online business through the entire concept of affiliate marketing. So this training will show you how to pretty much succeed with any product that you want to you know, promote online, whether it's products on ClickBank, GVZoo, whether it's you know like a network marketing opportunity. I mean, this training will show you how to succeed with just about anything that you want to sell or promote online. So that's really what that training all goes over. And it even gives you an entire ecosystem to leverage. So that's why I really enjoy it a lot. And that's why I just cannot recommend it enough. It is one of the best uh, trainings that I've ever seen out there. And I highly encourage you to check that out if you are really uh, serious about building an online business, you know, in, in 2020 or even beyond that. So anyways, hope you enjoyed this video and take care.